Hey everyone, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to get DLSS in Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So when you're in game and you go to the upscalers section, the only thing it has is FSR. And it might not even be FSR 2, like it could be FSR 1, uh, based on how it looks. Um, so you, you'd probably be surprised to learn that this game actually does have DLSS. You know, if you go inside the, the game's folder, you know, right here. BBQ game, plugins, DLSS, binaries, third party. There like there it is. It's DLSS. Let's see what version it is. Uh 2.3. It's a pretty older version, so you know, I'd recommend updating it to like 2.5.1 or using DLSS tweaks. But anyways, so it's it's in the, the game file, so it works. But it's not enabled, it's not in the the settings in game, so how do you enable it? Well, you go to this location, I'll leave the path to it in the description, and then you go, if, if you have the game on Xbox Game Pass, um, where it says Windows Client, it'll say like uh, Game GDK or Win GDK instead, I'll, I'll leave a link to the path as well, but anyways, you go here, and then you find the game user settings file. And then right up here, you should see a DLSS. Switch this to true. And then as for the number, each of these numbers correspond with the DLSS um, quality level. So I assume zero is quality, one's balance, two is performance, three is ultra performance. But it could also start with one being quality. So, you know, just try any value from like zero to four. Um, if anyone figures it out, I'll, you know, leave the the quality levels in the description or a pinned comment. But after you change those settings, you want to save the file and then switch it to read only so the game can't change it. And you should have DLSS when you're in game. Please note, if you try to change any upscaler options or graphic settings in game, it may undo the the tweak and you may have to restart the game. But yes, that is how it, it works. Thank you for watching.